Hello all, welcome back to the lecture. Now I want to explain you how to read and write a line to the file using the f get s and f put s. So there are two varieties of the function you can say f get s. It is used to read the line from the file and you can use the function f put s. It is used to write the line to the file. So first of all, I want to write the lines to the file and then I want to read the same back. So how we can do this? Very simple. Here you can declare the file pointer fp. Now here you can write fp is equal to f open. Now I am writing here f open data dot txt. I want to do the write first and then I want to read. So I am using the w plus. It means it will do first write and then I want to do the read also. Then you can simply close the file. Now I want to ask to the user that enter the paragraph. So I'm just writing here printf enter article. Now I will ask to the user that write the tilde for the exit. So whenever user press the tilde, now this article will not ask any more characters. So here you can write scanf percentage s instead of percentage only s yes, here you can write here in a square bracket you can mention that is not tilde it means until and unless it reaches to the tilde it will ask the character by character from the user and then you can just write your array over here so i'm just writing here character name of 1000 it means i'm just writing here name array 1000 storage of characters and then this article will be stored into my name variable. Now I want to write the same into the file. So you can call the function f put s. f put s has the two argument. One is the character pointer. So you can just pass your name array over here. And the name of the file. For example, name of my file is fp. So in this particular file, my content will be written. Now I want to read back. So how we can do this? Very simple. You can just set your position to the beginning of the file. So you can call rewind of fp. Whenever you write rewind of fp, your cursor will be set to the beginning. Now here you can simply write the condition while not feof of fp. It means until and unless the end of file is not reached to the file, just use the function that is get s and based on the get s just retrieve the value you can just call the function that is f get s whenever you call f get s it has the three argument one is the character pointer in which you want the data so i want the data in for example name variable now how many characters in one line you want that so for example i want the 100 characters so i can just pass here integer value 100 from which file you want the read line by line. So I want to read uh, from the file that is fp. So these are the three argument. This name variable will have the value that is 100 characters and it will be stored in, uh, it will be retrieved from the file that is fp. Now here you can simply call your function that is printf and you can print here your name value. Once it is stored into the name, so what it will do, it, it will retrieve the 100 characters line by line from file pointer and it will store into name variable. Now you can simply print your percentage S and name. Whenever you write this, it will simply run this particular code and now it will ask me to enter the article. So I'm just writing here that is hello all. I hope you all are enjoying. Thanks and regards. Now I'm writing here that is Atmir. Now I'm just pressing the tilde sign. Whenever you press the tilde sign, your content will be over. So the same content will be read from the file and the content is available over here. And you can verify your content into the file also. For example, in my this folder data.txt is just created. You can just open that particular file and you will be able to see that the hello all. I hope you all are enjoying. Thanks and regards. Atmiya. It means you can read and write to the file using the f get s and using the f put s. F put s is used to write the content to the file and f get s is used to 
read the content from the file. For example, let me save this particular program that is demo 7. Now what I want to do, I want to open this particular file that is my demo 7.c and I want to read the content of this particular file then you can simply use the same loop that is while not f e o f of f p it means until and unless it does not reach to the end of file simply retrieve the 100 characters into name line by line and simply print the name variable whenever you run this particular code you will be able to see the same content of the file that is demo 7.c over here you can just scroll this so you will be able to see that the line by line every line is read from this particular file so now suppose if anybody asks you that print the alternate line all these things then you can use this particular program to do the same so using the f get s and f put s we can simply read the line and we can write the line so that's it from my side if you like this video then please like share and subscribe to my channel thank you all have a nice day